So now in today's video, we're going to take another look at my new multimeter. So this is the TAC Life DM06. And in this video, we're going to look at the non-contact voltage detector. And on top of the meter, we have this probe here. You see NCW for non-contact voltage. And what that means is we can tell if there's a voltage somewhere using this meter without making a an electrical connection and so that's what the non-contact means and of course here's my laptop power supply the laptop is on right now but uh, it inputs about uh, 120 volts alternating current and outputs about 19 volts of uh, direct current and and so this meter will give us three different readings based on the voltage that it senses and so it makes a lot of beeping noises too that's why I'm doing a lot more explaining and a lot less demonstrating than normal because uh, the beeping is very annoying the camera really picks up the beeping and uh, so I'm not gonna torture you with that too much so when we have about 12 volts or more that the meter senses because remember it actually has to sense it it's not going to give us an exact value of the voltage it's it's not that uh, not that great at sensing it but it warns you that there is a voltage basically so we'll get uh, two bars when it senses about 12 volts or higher as I said we got 19 coming out of here and it will also beep when we get to about 40 volts or higher that it senses we'll get four green LEDs and even more beeping. Now when we get to 80 volts and higher that it senses, we'll have those four green LEDs and then two red LEDs and even more beeping. And so now to actually take the reading, we just have to hit the power button, turn it on, and then we'll be holding down the uh, non-contact voltage button. And I'll do that now. I got to keep it away from uh, the power supply because it can sense it that far away as you can see there but uh, in any case we get close to this wire we only got two bars for about 12 volts and then most everywhere it senses at least 40 volts and if we hold it just right here we can tell that there's over 80 volts and now we'll do the same with this uh, six-way power supply and you can see it's live right now when I turn it off then we get nothing so we know that it is off right now 